Hello everyone. In this video, I would like to talk about such an almost invisible but at the same time useful part of the plumbing faucet located on its spout and referred to as an aerator. Also, in this video, we will find out what troubles a faulty or clogged aerator can cause. Aerator faucet is a very useful device, without which, a stream of water pouring from a tap would be thin and not so bubbling. The task of the aerator is to saturate as much as possible with air the water flow coming from the spout of the tap from which the water jet becomes voluminous, foamy, which in turn allows to reduce the water consumption itself. The aerator consists of a body and several grids with holes of different diameters. Many people know that the aerator is capable of clogging and needs to be cleaned or replaced from time to time. But, not everyone is aware that the clogging of the grid may cause the appearance of hot water where, in fact, it should not be. For example, in a flush toilet bowl. We learn how this happens. In a situation where the pressure of hot water and cold water in the room has different indicators, more often, the pressure of hot water is higher than that of cold. Imagine the simplest home water system, where a faucet, shower and toilet flush tank are installed, and the pressure of hot water is higher than that of cold. When you turn on a working mixer, streams of hot and cold water falling into the body of the tap and mixing, and with virtually no resistance at the outlet, pour out from the spout through the aerator. Now consider the operation of the mixer with a clogged aerator. When the mixer is turned on, flows of hot and cold water falling into the body of the tap are mixed, heading to the spout of the mixer, where at the end they encounter resistance in the form of a clogged aerator. The mixed water, with difficulty and not in full, passes through the clogged aerator, and at the exit, we see a weak stream of water. Since the aerator creates excessive resistance for the free passage of water, part of the hot water whose pressure is initially higher through the mixer, gradually displacing cold water, fills the cold water main. At this moment, during the discharge of water in the toilet, the pressure of the cold water drops even stronger and hot water rushes to the filling toilet flush tank. In such a situation, with a sufficiently long flow of water through a clogged aerator, for example, a bath set, hot water can fill the entire cold water pipe in the house. And the neighbors from the toilet and faucets, instead of cold water will also flow hot water. How to deal with this? Faced with this situation, first of all check the aerators on the faucets located in your home. It is advisable to know what pressure at the entrance to the apartment for hot water and cold water, you can do this by installing pressure gauges showing the pressure in your system. A simple shower head or a hygienic shower can play a cruel joke, because they, like the aerator, have less throughput and also create resistance to the flow of water. In this case, the situation can be remedied by the installation of check valves in the water unit for hot and cold water supply. But, you need to understand that by doing so you will limit the possibility of mixed water getting into the common pipe, but you won't solve the problem in the apartment, since mixing the water into the same toilet will continue. Therefore, check valves must be installed on each mixer. Some mixers can be retrofitted by installing a valve directly under the sink, and the mixers, which are installed directly on the wall, can be equipped with special adapters with a check valve. Or, it's easier to buy a new mixer with integrated check valves. In order to eliminate the pressure difference between hot water and cold water in the apartment, as well as to protect the domestic water supply network from the external pressure drops, you can install water pressure reducers at the entrance to the apartment. Therefore, do not neglect the installation of check valves, think about your neighbors, and also do not forget to periodically check the aerators in the mixers, clean or replace them with new ones. That's all. Subscribe to my channel, good luck to everyone.